Oliver Trevina here at the Young Hollywood Studio with Kristen Lambert, Derek McKee, and Lance Burton. How are you? Great. Hi, well, well, thanks thank for coming in, yeah, all three absolutely. of you. Thank you for having and us. you guys obviously know Lance Burton, but these two are magicians too. Very magical so far. Make believe your uh, documentary. This is work. There's something really wrong. Like there's, it just doesn't match up. Magic and just being a teenager were supposed to be two different things. And then somehow they both collided. There's a thing called the World Magic Seminar in Las Vegas, mm -hmm. and we all met up. Um, it's a big competition, like the World Team Championships in Magic. Yeah, but they, what they do that's really special is they have a teen weekend where they've got seminars and, and workshops and, and ways um, to, to really work on your craft, and that's, Lance sponsors that, and so that's how we right. met Lance, that's how I met Derek, because we went, uh, went through the program together and, and competed. Uh, at, at the competition there. And you've done this from a young age, right? Yeah. Yeah, I started when I was six, actually, with the Lance Burn Magic set, so. That was a cute little revelation yeah, make, we had. You're you making him feel like he's been around for a while. <laughs> I, I feel old all of a sudden. Yeah. I, I should not be on a show called Young Hollywood. You should be. It's magic. What made you guys want to get into it? Well, it's something that people, older people than me, can can't explain. Right. I think for me, it's the whole aspect. I'm definitely like logically driven and all about you know problem solving, puzzle solving. And then when I encountered this this magic trick where there, you know, all of the doors of possibility are closed and it's just this completely impossible feat, I was absolutely fascinated. And no more Vegas, Lance. I, I'm retired. Yes. Retired. Yes, I'm happily retired. I think you can do that after fifteen thousand or something shows, right? Thirty years, Thirty fifteen thousand shows. Yeah. Hang your hang your feet up. And, and, and I'm. I'm making room for these these kids. <laughs> yeah, let them through. They're they're gonna they're gonna need jobs in Vegas soon. Yeah, it looks that way. Well, they're on the right track. Can we uh, see any magic? Yeah. Would you? I know you're an actor, and I'm sure you have a, a pretty pretty solid imagination. Would Thank you? you, would you <laughs> I like uh, this one. <laughs> would you be interested in playing a little game with your imagination, perhaps? Yeah. Be careful, but yes. Okay. okay no, we're gonna. <laughs> that's the thing, though. We're gonna use cards. Brave. We're gonna we're gonna use cards so that we um eliminate any okay. sort of uh, extra issues. But anyway, if you just place out a palm for me, I want you to imagine that I'm placing four cards into your hand. Right. And, and that shouldn't be very hard because Don't I, 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 oh sure, I, it shouldn't be very hard to imagine that because I am placing four cards into your hand. But I'd like you to imagine that those four cards are the four queens. And it, again, that shouldn't be very hard because they are the four queens. Now, I want you to imagine me removing two queens of the same color. In your imagination, did I remove the red queens or the black queens? Red. You're absolutely right. So I'm going to turn one of those red queens face up. Tell me, in your imagination, did I turn over the queen of diamonds or the queen of hearts? Queen of hearts. You're absolutely right. See, I knew you'd pick the queen of hearts because I did, in fact, turn it over. And, and I also knew you'd pick the queen of hearts if you put your palm out because um, I, I brought it from another deck. And I also knew you'd pick the queen of hearts because I didn't even bother to bring the other three. Yeah, you're weird. <laughs> <laughs> you're a bit strange. That's great. It's good. It's good. And top that, Derek. Right. Um, actually, do you have a cell phone I can? Yes. Uh, okay. Not that I should have my cell phone, obviously, in my pocket. <laughs> yeah. at work. Okay. Um, so it's an iPhone. Um, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a balloon. Come here, check out the balloon. Obviously, iPhone and balloon. Sure. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's a balloon. And then we're going to turn on, um, to make it more interesting, we're actually going to take turn on the um, face camera to watch. This is really oh, cool. cool. Watch. Oh, I don't want to do that. Now watch the balloon poke on it just to make sure there's nothing funny. It's not going to pop up. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, I'll get you back for that one. Take the balloon. Here we go. Wow. <laughs> That's really good. Thank you. And the cell phone is actually in the balloon right here. We're going to... Yeah. Wow. Here, check it out. Just make sure there's nothing... Yeah. That's... Okay, I'm just right. Hold out your hand. Here. Hold out your hand. 
Okay. Pretty good. And what's your favorite or favorite trick? Or, I assume oh. that that's. Oh. At the end of Lance's show, he makes a Corvette <laughs> float. That was in the box that Lance Burton had. That's the Lance Burton magic kit. You didn't get that when you're. You, no, you just got a few more sales then. If that is in the box set, I'll go and done, buy it. Done, done, well. done. Um, well, guys, thanks for stopping in. Um, I've got a little magic trick of my own. It's probably going to impress you. So, um... Wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, we got to make it come back. We got to make, yeah. This is not quite satisfying. I've never saw that one before. That was good. Wait, Derek, we can do this. Ready? All right. I don't know. We, we were just about to leave. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. One trick I wanted to do that I could do. No, you, you, guys you brought back the dog. And you've got a dog in it as well. You brought back oh, the dog. She's gone. <laughs>